Well, good evening, everybody. I'm really excited about our little session tonight. Um, I know some of you can't make it, but we are going to um, just kind of work through something that's really important, and that's your two-minute story. Um, and, you know, when you're talking two-minute story, we mean two-minute story. So I'm going to actually do a timer while you guys are sharing as well, for those of you that, that are ready, um, or that have prepared something. And I'm going to be sharing some of the uh, the stories that people had um, had sent me because um, it's really, really important as a leader at, or as you're building your neolife business that this is um, one thing that you really should get comfortable with. It should come naturally um, without reading. But believe, tonight and the next maybe couple of weeks, you might be reading it. But eventually your goal is for it just to be coming out naturally, especially when you're talking and, and connecting um, with people. And uh, I'm so grateful that Sean sent me her story because Sean, uh, and I know she's going to be listening to this and uh, she knows, um, you know, when she talks to people, she is so excited. And she was like me um, 35 years ago where I rambled and went on and just talked about everything. And, and I thought the more I said, the more I'll get people interested in what I do. And, and sometimes you scare people away and you don't realize, you know, why they're backing off or why they're saying no. Um, so I'm going to start off by reading Sean's. Oh, was that? Oh, sorry. And then, and then what we could do is um, we could maybe give Sean some tips on how we felt, or maybe if there's some ideas on what we could um, improve. This is like a, a working, uh, working workshop. Okay. So here she is. I was introduced to Neil Life 28 years ago. The products changed my life. When I started taking the products, my husband and I were, were financially comfortable and we had great jobs. We weren't looking for additional income at that time. We were newly married. Over the years, I've shared products, the products with friends and family. I've stayed close with Nada. Sorry, that noise is loud. Sorry. I've, I've stayed close. Sorry. I've stayed close with Nada and the positive community and culture. I noticed that I was starting to receive a small income by sharing these products and opportunity with others who are struggling financially and with their health. Over the last few years, I've, I've started to realize how I can positively impact people's lives. My husband is set to retire in the next few years now, and, and now I understand how I can do something I love and supplement my retirement income. Would you be open to looking at this opportunity to see if it's a fit for you? What do you guys think? Sean's going to be listening to this later. Was it two minutes? <laughs> yeah. 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 It was just under two minutes, actually. Perfect. Yeah. Any, how did you feel? Can you, you can it? I could identify with it. I could, and, and, uh, bravo. Say bravo. Okay. You know, like that's fantastic, really. Yeah. Okay. Anybody else? Oh, history. I was missing, I feel like something that she really loved about like the products or Neolife, like that one thing for her. Say that again? You were feeling? Like there was something missing, um, like the one thing about Neolife that like really that she loves maybe, like something that she okay. hooked her, okay. you know what I mean? Okay. So um, when she yeah. says, um, I'm just trying to think here. Sorry. Yeah, you're right. Because she didn't share how the she did share how. Um, hang on, I've started the product. My husband and I were uh, the products changed my life. Is all she said, right? Maybe so something more specific. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's very good. Yeah. So yeah. the product changed my life. Um, I struggled with uh, some serious digestive issues because she did, um, and um, she also had, um, yeah, I'll tell her to put a couple of things in there on, on the, on the products and how they changed her life. Excellent. Kamea. Yeah. Cause you're right. A little more heart, right? Okay. Anybody else? You're muted. Joan, I, now. I was going to say something along that lines as well, that, um, uh, cause even for myself, as I'm so new into it, what I got from that first and foremost was the longevity. So uh, that was a key component to, to hear something that's uh, someone who has been in it for so long, even for your, for yourself, that to know that 
this is not something that is just fly by night. You know, it's and one of those companies, another one of those. It's it's actually something that shows um, that that there's history. It's it's got good backing of it. Um, okay. But yeah, I, I did think that there was something um, uh, like what product or like what was her right. and right. I, I when it comes to the part of being a little bit more open sometimes like myself included I'll, I'll throw it out there I'm I'm a little bit more private still like so I'm not sure what my boundaries are what what I'm willing and ready to share right now mm -hmm. so I kind of I kind of got that from it that okay maybe she doesn't want to share um th that part like what what pains her mm -hmm. that she got resolved from being with Neo Life, and mm -hmm. uh, but they, like for myself, as I'm thinking of of something, I I look at okay, I don't know if I want to self diagnose myself, mm -hmm. but I guess to for lack of a better term, maybe I'm exhibiting or experiencing symptoms that would be associated with perimenopause or menopause, and mm -hmm. the the hormones and everything is like so out of whack that that's that's kind of where my story is is going, right. Uh, so I, I'm like, okay, but what product did I, <laughs> because I'm kind of all over the place. I'm trying yeah, to yeah. different products right now. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll get together and we got to create a story <laughs> of what's happening now mm -hmm. and why you're, why you're excited about sharing and why you're looking for people that are willing to, that are, m might be open to taking a look. So we'll, we'll, and, and your story, everybody's story is going to change. Mm -hmm. as you grow as you evolve as you build your business it'll change mm -hmm. okay so yeah you're a brand new you're yeah. you know, brand brand new so your story is going to be very My story different. right now is what's keeping me going right that's what I'm looking at it's like oh I'm like oh I'm only been three months <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it's like three months that's really that's really green I'm green or yeah. <laughs> you are um, green but yeah. I mean, what's keeping me on it so uh, what uh, what I could honestly say is um, I've been exposed to many uh, products in my career and um, I, I've never stayed this long actually with a product. So it's to me, there's it's the scientific backing. It's the the all about the health. It's all about uh, having a better life, better quality of life. Mm -hmm. We spend the money as it is so, like it's it's money that you know, when you, when you break it down to like how much per day and how much people are just talking to someone today and she was going through the Tim Hortons drive through And when she went through the Tim Hortons drive through and she went to pay, I thought, oh my gosh, like, even when we think about like the coffees that people go out, it's like, wow, yeah. they replace yeah. that coffee with, you know, a shake and you're spending the same amount of money. You got it. <laughs> Good yeah. girl. So yeah, yeah, we'll we'll work on a story together. Yeah. yeah. Once you start to hear some of the examples tonight, just make some notes and then we'll maybe we'll, we'll work on something tomorrow together. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I was like, I don't have a specific product yet. Yeah. So it's in my story. I can't actually say, oh, this fix this. Well, we're, we're not really yeah. wanting to talk about specific products either. That's not what the story is. The story is just to be like, even with Sean, you mm -hmm. know, like she was, she had, a few health challenges, but you don't want to be talked too much about that because yeah. you don't want people to think, Oh, I have to have that disease or I have to have that or, or, right. and we can't say that, you know, the products fix Here. anything, but yeah. you can yeah. definitely say like, for me, it was my mom was in a lot of pain and, and inflammation, right? So you can talk about things like that. Mm -hmm. Um, but so yeah, definitely we'll, we'll connect and talk, but you know what, I, this is the perfect time. I think Yuli, are you ready? Yes, I am. She's got, because Yuli has been around a long, long time as well. And now she's more focused in the business than ever. So we really had to kind of create something that would, especially because you do a lot of networking, Yuli. Mm -hmm. um, so I'd love for you to share yours. Okay. Hello, my name is Yuli Lee. 12 years ago, I was introduced to an incredible health and wellness company. At that time, I was busy growing my own events business, which I had started several years prior. I was financially comfortable, but it wasn't enough to fulfill my dreams for retirement. I, I also realized that it did not allow me to build long-term relationships with my clients. I missed that personal connection. However, um, I was experiencing amazing results using the supplements and I started to share 
with others. <clears throat> I realized that the supplements changed my life. And as a result, I started sharing with others and noticed my income also began to grow. My passion has always been to help others. So when I found an opportunity that benefited me, I felt obligated to share with others. The personal satisfaction I felt from helping others build a team and achieve financial goals has given me incredulous satisfaction. Now I'm looking for people to lock arms with, to grow, inspire, and impact their lives. Would this be something you'd be open to taking a look at? That was pretty good, right? That was pretty good for, for a first take, Lily. Um, yeah. A couple of times you said others a bit too much. So Several yeah, times, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll clean that up a little bit. Shelly? I, and I'm going to say, you, Lily, you had this as Sean did. And I think it depends on who you're wanting to link arms with um, because both of your stories are similar in that you started out, you know, you both had jobs or a career or something and you were comfortable, mm -hmm. but then something was lacking and you wanted to shift over. And, and I, li I like that part of it of saying, yeah, everything was going great, but I wanted more. So therefore mm -hmm. I, I needed something else that would support that. And so I, I like that in both of them. Um, and I think there is a difference between somebody who's been working for a while that that would um, work well with versus somebody who's just out looking for, you know, needing something like right now earlier in their life, maybe. Right. So it really depends on on how you would do it. The, the other the one thing that I did notice, and I'm going to say, Lee, I do exactly the same thing just because mm -hmm. I try to write a paragraph and, and maybe it would be different when you're when you're talking. I, the, the beginning was really smooth and, and I know this is your first time kind of going over it. And then all of a sudden you went, however, da, 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 da. And, and all of a sudden it tweaked in me that it sounded like a paragraph rather than a conversation and a story. Unless you go, unless you're talking, you go, but however, this is kind of what happened. You know, it depends how you're saying right. it, right? you know, with, with, but, but there was something there that all of a sudden kind of lost me a little bit as mm -hmm. to, yeah, because it got, it got, essay writing kind of focus, which is what I do a lot. So I guess that's why I can pick it out. <laughs> Just have a look. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. I, I know what you're talking about because I wasn't I sort of tried to fix a little fix it a bit this afternoon, but didn't have time to really find um, fine tune it. Yeah. And I think when you read it aloud in front of people, that's when it you realize, oh I got this doesn't flow as as nice, right? So yeah, yeah that's why practicing is important. Awesome. Thank yeah. you. There's a difference between uh written language and when you speak to write the words. So you have to be careful with that too, you know, mm -hmm. when you're yes. telling a story. Mm -hmm. yeah. Excellent. Okay. All uh, right. I have I have something um for you Lily as well. And and it, it's partly has to do with the um you know, the written versus the kind of just naturally speaking to somebody. And it might be my hearing because I was listening, but at, towards the end, um, you, I thought I heard you say incredulous, but in that sentence, it should be incredible because a person is incredulous and a thing is incredible. So I'm not sure if I heard it right or not, but just you watch did. the use of that. You did because yeah. I liked the word and I didn't really know the meaning and you really explained it to yeah. me. And I thought it was I thought it was right in that context. But thank you for for our teacher librarian for clearing that uh, up for us. It's just, it's just it's a point of grammar. Great, it sounded great for me. I love and, the word. Well, and, you and were you incredulous. You were incredulous when she said it. Right. <laughs> but but you're correct, Heather and and Nada, because it was the when we wrote it first. Within the context, it was incredulous. But I, because I tweaked some things just now, and while you were talking, I realized I should have changed it to incredible and not incredulous. Oh, so, oh, but so you had it right. Okay. Yeah. You did have it right. The pro. There you go, Yuli. So it's not okay. It's not you. That's okay. <laughs> that's okay. That, that's, that's good. Still, that's still good. learning. That's for sure. That's for sure. That's why we're here tonight. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Uh, Kamea, or actually, uh, Shelly, did you want to maybe give that example for the um, with the gym or do you want to wait till after? I'll let Kamea go first. Okay. Awesome. All right, Kamea, girl. Go, girl. You got to unmute yourself, though. Okay. 
I always get a little nervous, so let me just take a bit of deep breath. Here. <laughs> okay. Hello. Okay, how about this, Camille? Okay, Camille, what's new? Um, what have you been up to lately? Hey, yeah, so back in the summertime, I met Shelly and Nada at a booth, and I ended up talking to them for two hours. I was blown away by what they were sharing with me, a company with no animal testing, lots of vegan products, and I was hooked. They invited me to go to Texas to learn more the following Friday, and I spent some time at home, thought it over, and I thought, yeah, I'm just I'm just kind of crazy enough to do it. So I booked a flight, went to Texas to learn more, and I had an incredible two days meeting so many people from Neolife, sharing their incredible health stories, and surrounded by people wanting better for themselves and better for their life. I ended up leaving Texas and I think the following evening I signed up to be a, be a promoter so that I can not only benefit from these amazing products and I can help myself earn income on the side and build a business throughout my youth to supplement my main job with more income. So I have yeah, I've been doing that, and <laughs> I don't know how to end it. <laughs> but would you, would you be open to taking a look and yes. and and locking arms with me or something like that? Be open to joining my team and growing alongside with me as I grow. <laughs> yeah, excellent, yeah. excellent. Woohoo! <laughs> you might even be able to squeeze in. Are you crazy enough? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not, but you know, if you know them really well and you know they've got a crazy side to them, like just like you, just yeah. like you think you do. Then, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that and, that language might work for her for her like some of the people in your life, Kamea. Yeah, honestly, I know some people it would, and I'm just thinking though, I didn't mention like how I remember uh, one thing that really stands out to me, I guess, of that day when I met you guys was when I was sharing about my stomach IBS stuff, and you guys just said, and my allergies, and you guys just said we're going to help you like you're not going to feel like that anymore like we're going to help you and like I just had so much like trust in you so like I can also bring that in I think because it I didn't know how long that was but I think it was really short actually you know what you're right because and you're going to hear Kamea's story on Thursday uh, Shelly's going to interview her as one of the testimonials um powerful story powerful story so you guys are in for a real treat um on Thursday but I really I, I think you need to maybe put a little blurb in there and the products truly helped me in so many ways and that just kind of enhanced you know the rest of it right I, yeah I could say and over the last six months I've not only improved but that improvement has helped me propel my business forward too like because of that so yeah mm -hmm. I definitely add that in okay thank excellent you. awesome thank you all right Shelly girl <laughs> Well, I was I was just chatting with Nada because um, you heard last Tuesday what I would say if I was meeting somebody for the first time and just kind of sharing my background and how, you know, my world kind of turned upside down and now the business was going to help me move forward and stuff. But I happened to be at the gym uh, yesterday and I saw one of the one of the guys who used to work there and he had left the gym to go work uh, someplace else to follow another path that he was going on. So when I saw him, so I, I think why I'm sharing this is sometimes you have in your head, because I kind of was walking out going, okay, I need to share my story with him and I'm going to go over and share it. And in my, in my head, it was the whole two minute one that I was going to share with them. But sometimes you have to be ready to just pivot. Okay. So, so I said to him, Hey, I said, nice to see you back at the gym. And he said, yeah, I have my day off. So I'm able to come back uh, in and work out. And I said, so how's it going at the new, at the new job? And he went, yeah, it's going okay. And I said, oh, I said, are, are you able to work from home? And he went, well, not yet because I, I'm still so new, but hopefully in the future, I'll be able to work from home. Um, so I, so I, I put that in there because I know the younger generation like that flexibility. And I know more and more people want a little bit of time freedom. And, and then I said, so like, like, what exactly are you doing or how are you building? And so he told me that he was more, and, and I can understand this with that when you start a job, you're at the lower 
lower kind of um, level in a company and then he wants to be able to to build up but I just got this feeling that yeah it was going okay but he was missing a lot and you know obviously he would give it time and and I just I cut to the chase I just kind of said would you be open to looking at a another at a side gig and and he says you look like you love it and I went absolutely I love it it's just great and he went, yeah, I'd be, I'd be open to look. I said, okay. I said, why don't, uh, why don't you send me your, your, you have your phone there and I'll just text it to me and I'll send you a video later on. And while he was getting it out of his phone, I just kind of said, you know what? You're going to love the company. It's international. It's been around since 1958. Everything is health and wellness, just like what you like. And everything is based in science. And he said, it's based in science. And I said, absolutely. I've been with them 15 years. And then, and then he gave it to me and I said, you know what, I'll let you uh, get back to working out and I'll send you the video and we'll, we'll chat after that. And that's, that's all I said. I didn't, you know, I just, I cut to asking him questions because he didn't quite seem content and, and gave him an option. And he said, yeah, because I was so enthusiastic about it. Awesome. So instead of a two minute story, there's a little a bit little like you're more intrigued on him and him and getting him to share his journey with you. And you just had you might have a solution for him, right? Absolutely. I, I wasn't sharing so much about what had happened in my life and what, you know, why this is so good and would they be interested. It was tell me what's going with you because I'm getting, you know, I'm getting a few vibes that something is missing right now and and hopefully you know he moves up and that's great but he can do this on the side because I know because he used to work at the gym that he likes health and wellness too so it could be a good balance what video did you send him Shelly um I sent him the discover neo life uh, dot com right the Alan, one that the one that Alan Blaine uh had made mm -hmm. yeah okay it's I in the know. board. It's in the board's app, and if you don't know how to find it, let us know, and we can send it to you. It's if it's the one that I would send, especially if you're talking to a guy, um, because it, the way Alan presents it, I think sometimes it's better to come from another guy. Like remember that third party, right? And he does a really good job when it comes to the business. Okay, thank you, mm -hmm. Jelly. I loved how he could already tell how much you loved it, which will make him more interested in your story when you have the chance to like speak to him about it too. Yeah. Yeah, and sometimes. I think it's having the story ready with all the information and you just use pieces of it. We have to be ready, but you just mm -hmm. use the pieces of it you need to use. That, that's yeah. mm -hmm. And I'm going to say in this instance, I knew him because I, knew him and chatted with him when he was working there. And I knew him while he was in the journey of, of making the change. And so I saw him a couple of times before saying, Hey, you know, how's it going? And he says, yeah, starting off on the new job. Well, you know, hope it works out for you. And, and, you know, I'll, I'll ask the next time I see you. So we had a bit of a, a relationship there already. And he sees me working out and being fit and, and all the rest too. So that, that I'm sure helped in it as well. So Excellent. Anybody else uh, have something prepped? Joan, are you ready? So I'm going to, I changed mine, so I'm going to read it. Okay. okay. So yeah, you know, I, I don't, I, honestly, tonight is for reading. Like tonight is, I, I, I we want to make sure we can, you know, make it perfect. <laughs> John, same information, but I shifted things. Okay. Hi, my name is Joan Poon. I'm a retired registered nurse. When I was introduced to Neo Life 29 years ago, I had just returned to work after taking a year off for my treatments for breast cancer. I was not in the best health and after chemo, and I wished I didn't have to return to that stressful hospital environment and the shift work. I had no choice because we needed the money. So I'm putting in some business in there, right? Excellent. So I started focusing on my health. I was looking for something to boost my immune system and my energy level. When I was introduced to Neolife, I was drawn to the science and it made a lot of sense to me. I decided to give the products a try and within a few weeks, I felt a huge difference in my energy level. My immune system got stronger over time. I didn't get sick as often, and I was even able to get rid of the seasonal allergies that plagued me for years. I got excited 
And with this newfound energy, I started sharing my story with everyone, especially my coworkers who are always tired, especially from the shift work. I started getting a check at the end of the month, so I started sharing with more people and my checks got bigger. That's when I took a serious look and started building the business. The first thing I thought was, what if I could take early retirement so I could be away from the stress and the shift work? I'm happy to say that I was able to do just that 14 years ago because my near life income was able to complement or supplement, complement, supplement, teach, teacher, <laughs> yeah. Um, complement, supplement, supplement my retirement pension. I love working from home and I continue to help people, but in a different capacity by helping them to be proactive with their health and also help them with their financial needs. I just love this community where we, are all, where we all have a shared mission. Most of all, I like the fact that I can leave my business to my children and my grandchildren. And what a great legacy to leave behind. Just two more lines, so on. So if you're like me and looking for a way to not have to work till you're 65, or you're just looking for a side gig to make ends meet, or you have some big dream like traveling the world, Neo Life is a great vehicle. If you have some health goals to maintain your good health or you need help with some health issues, the Neo Life products are the best you can find. So we invite you to come along on our mission to offer hope and good health to everyone. Oh, that's really good. Wow. That was really good. <laughs> yeah. Kind of yeah, we intertwined it together. I don't know if, if that was me meeting you for the first time. I'd like to know more and and, and take a look for sure. Anybody else? Yeah, yeah, uh, you're right. Um, it's supplement, and I like supplement because it's a good double entendre because you've already talked supplement, right? You supplement an income, and they will be learning about supplement. So it kind of is a little seed just just kind of put in there. Um, so yeah, it, it supplement your income. I, I think our story has the seeds as well. What, whatever we say in our story, that's what people pick up on too, right? So mm -hmm. it's, it's very interesting what, what, what we're saying. Yeah. They go in that direction. If, if, they, if you go in the product direction, they'll go in the product direction. If you have business, they'll go in that direction too. So you try mm -hmm. to guide them through as well, depending mm -hmm. on what you want out of it, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to add a little bit in terms of if, if you're looking to cover both areas in terms of business and product, then, then I thought it was wonderful. I, th I think there was, you know, great information on both parts. I think if you're trying to shift and, and speak to somebody about the business, and then if that isn't the direction that they want, then shifting to product afterwards then I think you'd have to tweak it a bit I think it started out great and then that section where you put in quite a bit about your health if I was just interested in business you probably would have lost me a little bit because I'm listening a little bit too much to product at this point because I want to know about the business aspect mm -hmm. so it really depends and in, in, in my opinion on on what you're focusing on you know because yeah. And yeah. I, I think when you when you ask the questions, like I have my product testimonial as well, too. Right. Yeah. It's incorporated. Yeah. Just shift a bit to business because they, it, I mean, you intermarry them. That's the best way to, to yeah. marry two equally. And but if there's someone who has an illness, I'll go back to my product. Right. I oh, for sure. Yeah. Business, right. So that. Yeah. That's, yeah. I guess it all depends on the person that you meet. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I think you're the whole thing, Joan, is great. I think if you're in a, in a group environment and you're opening up a meeting and you share that. But if you're just bumping into somebody one on one, it might be a little too much on the product. You could might be just touch upon how, yeah, I, you know, I, I finished treatment. They helped me tremendously. And then just go into how that transitioned to the business. Oh, you mean like the part of the products, you mean the, the, the benefits? Did I give too many benefits? Yeah. Talk a lot about you, didn't leave, you didn't leave enough. You didn't leave enough for them to ask you more questions after. You told them everything right away. So I'll just say it helped improve my health. You know, like yeah. some Especially after, 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 after treatment. You, I, I think that's powerful to say they impacted mm -hmm. my life, especially after treatment. I was really struggling. And then just, and then just don't go into all the other stuff. 
that can come out later when they start when you they start asking you more questions. Yeah. Impact your life as being a 31 year, you know, thriver. Mm -hmm. And then and yeah, I mean, that kind of says a lot just in that statement. Mm -hmm. Always has. Yeah. I, I yeah. mean, I was going with the business by talking about uh, the struggles like having to work, right? That's a business. Mm -hmm. That's oh, a yeah. Business, right? Totally. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was great. That was really good. That part for sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you for the we'll video. practice it. We'll practice together a bit, Joan. I think because it's the first time we heard it. I'd like to, you to say it to me a few times over and over and we'll tweak it a little bit. Yeah. And again, you're going to have different versions for different mm -hmm. scenarios, right? So it's good to get good at saying it different ways. <laughs> right. Excellent. Anybody else? Heather, did you have one ready for tonight? Well, I didn't specifically get it ready for tonight, but I've been saying it for three days over the weekend. <laughs> Well, what? yeah, why don't we, yeah, let's see, let's see, let's see, and then maybe we can, this yeah, that'd be is, great. This is, this is going to be kind of off the cuff, but it's kind of my basic. Um, <clears throat> so I meet somebody and they say, so what are you doing? What have you got here? Um, hi, so, you know, 40, 40, not 45 years, Scott, start, start again. Um, so 26 years ago. I was living a very different life. I was teaching full time. I was super stressed and overtired, like it was fatigue. I couldn't believe how tired I was getting with my job. And I thought, really, if I feel like this in my 40s, what am I going to feel like in my 60s? And I was really not happy with that picture. I thought, this is not, this, I can't happen. And so, um, luckily, one of my parent volunteers in the school library. She was a retired nurse and she introduced me to this company, Neolife. And I thought, well, I might as well try the products because they're going to help, hopefully. And if they work, then, yeah, I, I was actually looking for a business to, because I thought if I retire, I'll have a pension. But I knew that that wasn't going to be enough for me to have the freedom I wanted at retirement. And I didn't even know if I'd make it to retirement, but... Anyway, I, um, so I started and within a few short weeks, I couldn't believe the difference in my energy. Like I actually stopped digging in my garden and thought I've had a whole day's work and I've had dinner and got, you know, the kids, whatever, homework and whatever. And, um, I, and I'm still digging in the garden, have lots of energy. So I was surrounded by tired and stressed people at work. So I just wanted to share it with everybody, I thought. Hey, if, if it can help me, it, it could help them too. So I started sharing and um, it's, it's been wonderful, you know, over the years. I mean, I actually got the tax benefits along the way. I retired three years early. I didn't ever get my full pension, but, um, you know, I've enjoyed doing this through, throughout the last 26 years and I'm 71. I feel better now than I did in my thirties. So um, it, it really works. And I just love to help people. And if you want to help people, and help yourself to have a better life, the life you want and the love, the life that you love, then please join me. Let's talk. Well, that's so good, Heather. Yeah, I can see why people were standing at your booth and hanging around. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And I'm, I'm just going to say, Heather, you said earlier that at 40, you were kind of feeling like it was the end of fun life. And you didn't know what you'd be like in your 60s. So don't say at the at, because now at the end of your talk, you need to say now at 71, I am like much better than I was at 40. Don't go back to 30 because oh, you couldn't even back. talk about 30. You were talking about 40. Okay. Yeah, good point. Good point. <laughs> and that's <laughs> true because I've known you that long. <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, you're like the oh, it's great. energizer yeah. bunny. <laughs> Thank you. So what else? I, I, so have what? A, I have a thought. Do you know what? I think it started out absolutely wonderful. Amazing. Where I'm, I'm going to say um, it, it started shifting to the product apart again was, now what did you, oh, you said um, something along the line of, and I, we're going to try this product and, and if they worked, then something along that line of, okay. <laughs> So when I when I was listening to Ashley when she was talking about this, she she had mentioned if you mentioned something about, you know, if they work or how long it takes, you know, or whatever, 
you have just shifted the person that you're talking to into, I need to try these products for yeah. two, three, four, a year, two years, so that I can get my story before I'm going to shift over to business. Yeah. So, so that part there, I think I would tweak it somehow and just saying, I tried some products and oh my gosh, I can't believe how amazing that I felt and, yeah. and, and shorten that up just a little bit. And then at the end, I was waiting for you to kind of come back to the business and your, and your ending could have been for the business, but it also could have been for just the products. Cause read that to me again, where you kind of said something, if you'd like to come along with something along that line. I don't know how I can repeat it because it, I'm, I don't have it in front of me. Oh, oh okay. Sorry. It was, it, was different. It, was, okay. it was really off the cuff and you're absolutely right. Okay. Planting that, that when I heard myself say it, I thought, oh, you know, I actually don't even say that anymore. I did think it when I was first introduced, but I, I don't say that, you know, it's, it's okay. just, I was absolutely incredulous at how well the product. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 So, so I think there's something, the wording at the end was something along the line of, you know, so if you want to come along and, and see, you know, how great that you can feel as we kind of cut once again, and, or, and, and get the life that you want to live, yeah. that could also be a health one too, to yeah. be active or whatever. It doesn't necessarily mm -hmm. mean that you wanted to be part of a business. Mm -hmm. So just, just to right. tweak that wording so that, so that what you're actually offering them is the opportunity to earn some extra income. Mm -hmm. yes a little bit yes right yeah. thank you well something worked because I got two promoters this week Bad I know <laughs> I know and a member <laughs> <laughs> and a two member two members in the last week and two promoters so yeah absolutely yes. you're gonna get that's that awesome you're gonna, you're gonna if I may say too. Heather that that actually sounded um you know when you hear ads that come in you're watching YouTube or whatever and an ad comes in <laughs> And someone's talking like I like them personally, like I, I'm not knocking ads. I like the ads because they're usually geared to something that I like anyway. So if they, they know what I like. That actually sounded like, hey, like if you want, like I feel better. Like when you said that I'm in my 70s and I feel better than I did in my 30s, change it to the 40s. Absolutely. Like it was a trigger. I was like, oh, man, like she sounds like she's she knows what she's doing and she wants to to share it. So it actually sounded like a quick real that you could put on social media <laughs> and like just go zooming out there because it actually sounded like it <laughs> heather did you hear that make her real i don't i don't, I don't know how to, to do one but you sounded like you just did one <laughs> i could i could yeah you could she's good with social okay. media you can do it heather yeah. um that's great i'm gonna read megan's and i already know how i would like to tweak it but she, she's, uh, she sent it to me and I know she's listening. She's tied up right now. So um, I'm glad you sent it to me, Megan, because I definitely, I know we're going to get this, like we're definitely gonna make a few changes and but I want everybody to hear and see where we can make the changes. When I was first introduced to Neolife, I was struggling with my mental health. Endometriosis and autoimmune disease. It had become a daily struggle. When I started working with Sean, she couldn't help but to share the share stories and testimonials, testimonies because these products are simply amazing. Sean saw my daily struggles. When I started to see people who struggled with the same health concerns and the differences these products made for them, I couldn't resist. I started with Pro Vitality Pack, and now, and I'm now on an abundance of products. <laughs> I have been on these products for approximately two years now, and it's been a game changer. The struggles aren't daily anymore. Four months ago, I decided to look into the business aspect of the company because of the compensation, because the compensation opportunity to build a family and help people was so intriguing. Would you be open to exploring these products and the business opportunity to see if it suits your lifestyle? I have to remember, Megan's young, new, she's excited. She's, mm -hmm. you know, stepping out of her comfort zone. Let me tell you, very much so. Um, but uh, she's she's doing awesome. She's sharing and Sean's been a great mentor uh, for her. Um, so do you want me to share a little bit of, of what I, the things that I, okay, Heather, you go ahead first. Okay, so there's something, I know, I know that when you came to the abundance of products, it's kind of, it's a difficult hurdle to get over sometimes in finding just the right language. But you can always just say, you know, as I learn more, 
I added a few more products that kept making a difference to the way I felt. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it doesn't have to, because otherwise people say, oh, how many, right? Abundance. So, yeah. as, and because that's what's happened to many of us. As we learn more, we learn from the scientists, as we learn more, and we actually increase our own knowledge about nutrition and the role it can play. And what else do we want to get out of our body, out of our life? What do we want to do? So we, we realize that we can keep um, improving. You feel great? How much greater can you feel? Mm -hmm. And instead of the word pro vitality, I would say I started with a very simple, um, their, their basic health pack yeah. and slowly added a few more products. Yeah. Right. Rather yeah. than staying pro vitality. So I started with the basic mm -hmm. health pack. Mm -hmm. and, and then as I learned more, I added just a, a few more things. Yeah. It's not, it doesn't sound like if you say I started with abundance, people right away think, oh, no. I can't afford this. No. Right. And Megan, I think even you, like financially, she was careful. She started with pro vitality and then she, she understood the value. And then as she started realizing her, her health was more important, she started making ch changes and adjustments to where she was spending her money right? Because what's more important, right? And she valued that. Um, so that's great. Honestly, like, we'll work on this. But at least you, we've got a great foundation to work on. And uh, four months ago, I decided to look into the business aspect of the company, because the compensation opportunity to build a family, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll make that a little smoother. But yes, absolutely. And um, would you be open to exploring these products and business opportunities to see if it suits your lifestyle? That's good. She closed with the, with the question. Anything I, else? I really liked it. Like, I know, I think, I think Megan's around the same age as me. And like, just if I heard that from a friend, I know that I would be like really considering it, especially because I know they took their time with like testing the products for themselves and then getting started in the business. I think I, I liked her story in that sense and I didn't know her story. So nice there to hear. Is. Yeah. Awesome. Can I make a comment, Nada? Yes. And for the new people in general, for us, um, so it's duplicatable. I think we should look at the four questions whenever we we're doing it, and mm -hmm. it may seem, uh, you know, we can still add everything in, but always right. look at the four questions because what's what's the point you're trying to make each time? And sometimes we make points that doesn't really matter, right? In the whole, okay. so the, putting like the background, the pain, the solution. So doing that order. It's there's some duplication and it's easier for a new person to do it, right? When they're following that. And it might, it might sound kind of choppy, but that's okay. It's, it's duplication. Okay. So where you were before, right? What, where the, um, yeah, the pain, where the pound, what you found. Yeah. It's in the, well, those, yeah. Right. And the solution, right. And, and make it in those, in that flow. That in mind when you, when we're making it, when we're doing a story. Mm -hmm. it's something for them to follow it's easier to follow mm -hmm. okay excellent anybody else we just have a few more minutes before we head over to our our health talk anybody else want to share i've got two stories so i won't do them both but i'll give you a choice one is my product story and the other one is my business story okay let's do your business story okay. all right i'd love to because we know we know your product story but i want to hear your business story well, I think you'll recognize my business story too, because I see the date on it was August 21st of 2022. Okay. We're at Shelley's Cottage. Oh, yes. Okay. Ready? Oh, yes. Go. I retired after a 50 year career as a nurse, nurse practitioner. I loved being a nurse practitioner. It was a great career path for me. And I thought it was going to give me a generous pension to live on to the end of my days. But that didn't happen. My investments were hit hard during COVID, and it appeared that I would run out of money before I ran out of life. But here's the thing. I've been using some fantastic whole food products for almost 38 years. And I feel amazing. I decided to take a closer look at the income opportunity that was right in front of me. I realized it would help me get the money freedom I felt I had lost. For me, it was a way to travel, to support my favorite charities, and to just have fun with my kids and grandkids. This opportunity may or may not be a fit for you. Would you be open to checking it out? Wow. That was, that was a minute. That was a minute. It. 
and, uh, and what you absolutely said, and fantastic win. Yeah, you well, you helped on, me with it all, you guys. <laughs> yeah, no. It's focused on the it's focused on how the financial aspect was going to make a difference in your life. You mentioned about the products, but it didn't become the center of the talk. It was more about how the finances were going to give you freedom to do all those things that you wanted. It was awesome. Mm -hmm. When yeah, you keep very... sharing that, you keep sharing that with people out there, you're going to get promoters. I mm -hmm. need to be doing my story. Yeah. I just, yeah. I'm so like yeah. not with you it. You do, you do. <laughs> and, and it's, and, it, it, it's very conversational when you say, yeah. well, here's the thing, or it's right in front of me. You know, like that's yeah. real language. And it was, and it is. <laughs> so, I mean, they're real, it's real language in my my terms too. So, yep. Mm -hmm. I got to get out there and share my story. I know that. You right. do, girl. You just got to do it. The more you do it, you're going to, you're going to, you're going to say, now that got a new promoter. Now that I got a new promoter. Got a new promoter. It's like Heather. Got a new promoter. Got a new promoter. Got a new club member. No <laughs> oh my goodness, yeah. girl. Okay. Yeah, because I think we've complicated it, right? Like, because we've been around for so, so long, it's hard to just zip it, <laughs> just get right to the point. <laughs> well, and my story is different. I mean, I took the products for a very, very long time and was just not into doing the business because I was so busy being a nurse practitioner and traveling up to Nunavut and going here, there and everything. I did, I never thought of it. I did think of it. That's not true. I always thought it was it was a conflict, that I had authority with my patients and if I was to start yeah. telling them about this product would help you, this product is exactly what I took for the same reason or anything like that, I could get in trouble. I just right. felt all the time I could get in trouble with the College of Nurses. Right. Yeah. yeah you well, that's, that's a unique um, situation that you were in. So mm -hmm. it doesn't stop you from sharing with your, your friends and other people that you meet outside of your business. Well, I did share it with my bratty children, but... <laughs> <laughs> I love them. I love them. I love them. <laughs> All right. How about some of the newer Camille? How did you feel about Wen's story? Like being like the young, young, young gun. I really liked it. Yeah. yeah. It's it's it was really smooth and nice and just simple and lots of I think room for questions after too. Like mm -hmm. there's still obviously mm -hmm. um things that people will want to know more of. So it was the perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah yeah thank mm -hmm. you <laughs> awesome and you, everybody like always hears out <laughs> and rachel has a really good you we've been listening to rachel's story all like every week no like after week no. she's got a beautiful beautiful story so i i know i'm not sure if she's gonna want to come on but i know you're hopefully you're coming on at eight o'clock tonight rach she's probably getting her little guy ready for bed um but uh anybody else we got just just maybe time for one more if, uh, if anybody else wants to share. If you're not ready, just reach out and we can practice. Like I said, the more we practice, I know we'll get together, Tracy, and we'll uh, we'll put something together. And like I said, it's going to change as the months go. <laughs> well, I did one, but I, I'm listening to everybody and it's just so amazing because I'm getting the tips and hearing everything. Yes. I mean, I have nerves like crazy too. And yeah. I like what Tracy said too earlier too because – I'm kind of lost sometimes like, um, well, the story when you want to present and who is the audience. And I think right. that's where I was having trouble trying to do my story, trying right. to figure out, uh, you know, here's the pattern to follow. But when you actually meet somebody outside, I, I feel like I don't, I'm not going to say all of what I want to say. No, you don't. <laughs> you know? yeah, and you don't want to for I, sure. Listen with time, like how Wen did her is that was beautiful. And, and you know how you guys all talk about it because you're so, into it too right and and it can yeah. happen for us too but like i i think mine i wrote something down but i have to practice a bit more okay um, and practice with joan like that's why it's important like yuli and i practiced one-on-one -on -one together because yeah. she reached out to me so don't like just reach out to joan and practice and 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 you'll eventually and you'll change it a few times that's okay just like yuli made some changes and then she realized after the changes she thought oh right? I got to practice again and make some more changes. And that's okay. Eventually, you'll get there. Like I know when you you practice that, oh my gosh, a lot. I remember we, we've been working on on that story a while ago, right? I think when Ashley first joined uh, the team, 
So you've been practicing that. So that's why yours is a little more polished than, than some of us, but that's okay. That's why we're here. Practice, 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 reach out to somebody in your team, downline, sideline, upline. Um, you'd be surprised at how eventually it'll just start to flow naturally. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for all the advice, everybody. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to see you tomorrow. We're having a, an in-home at uh, yeah, Sydney yeah. tomorrow night in Barrie. Yeah. yeah. And everybody's coming. <laughs> Anna's coming too. <laughs> oh, excellent. So, excellent. All right, guys. Well, listen, I want to thank you all for joining us tonight. And hopefully Megan and Sean will listen to the recording and uh, and we'll, we'll tweak it a little bit more. But like I said, just reach out to us. And if you need any advice on making some some little changes, um, we can do that as a team. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thanks. So we'll see you over on the other side. I know some of us have guests tonight. So looking Thank forward you. to seeing you. Take care, guys. Good night. Good night.